Hey everyone! I know yesterday I just posted a video with my speculations of what breed is coming and it has been confirmed this morning by Star Stable on their social media and t on August 12th we are getting the Mirari. They posted the official render images today and I am in love so I thought I would share my initial reaction so there are eight of them, which I don't know if that means we're getting four and four or how that's working or if one of these is an NPC horse, because normally we either get um, seven horses or we've got nine um, or maybe there's no app horse. I can't tell. Also, I was trying to think, where are they being located? Because if you think about it, um, Golden Leaf stables doesn't have any horse lots available unless they are moving out the Hanoverians um, but there's isn't there trackers there I'm not 100% sure but I feel as though there's not enough space at Golden Leaf stables um, but they are coming August 12th and here is my initial reaction to them so if we go through each of the three images we'll start with the one um, with the horses on what would be our left and that is the white one the black one and the bay one and then there's uh, the butt end of a maximum Sabino um, so I think they're beautiful the bay is absolutely stunning with its dapples and what looks to be another badger face or part of a badger face I can't tell if it's broken up over the eye or not but it's gorgeous and then the black one, the black one does sort of remind me of the Lusitano's markings, the black Lusitano, but it's okay because the black Lusitano is stunning, and so I am perfectly fine if there's another horse like it. And of course the white one is gorgeous. Um, the Max Sabina one, I wish the mane and tail was less yellow toned, I wish it was more cool toned, like the, um, to match the white of the horse, but that's okay. Okay, um, we don't really get many Sabinos, especially Max Sabinos. I think the last Sabino we had was the Chincoteague Pony. Um, but this one is beautiful. The rear, I'm curious to see the movements because I'm not sure how the rear looks. I, I, I want to see what it looks like. Um, the rears where they kick out the legs like that aren't always my favorite, but I think the... I think the quarter horse does and it looks okay, so um, it'll be interesting to see that. And then there is the dappled dark bay pinto, and wow, this horse is gorgeous. It, I love it. Um, and then there is the, it looks sort of like um, a Palomino, Isabel Palomino type. And that one is beautiful too, has dapples, and it has a definite badger face, because we saw it in that preview that I posted yesterday. And then it looks like there's a Cremello, and another um, um, blazed face liver chestnut. These horses are so pretty, and their ears are perfect. I, I love them. I cannot wait to see the trailer whenever that comes out. Man. Star Stable did a great job. I'm pretty sure this breed was probably done by this uh, by Lisa, who did the Tinkers and the um, Quarter Horse, I believe she did, because I think they they like go every other um, crater team type type of thing. But yeah, they did an amazing job. I am so excited, and I cannot wait to see them in game. I doubt they had the special gate, right? I don't think the Marari ha does the Marari have a special gate? I don't know actually. Honestly, I don't really know that much about the Marari. <laughs> That's probably bad. I should do my research, but yeah. I love the tail. Actually, the um, what it looks to be the mane that the bay has, I can't tell if it's like flipped over the side or if it's like a a uh, sort of a roached mane or like a buzzed mane you know like a buzz cut mane sort of like I don't know the actual terms so don't judge me but I love the tail that's associated with that one 
it looks so elegant. It reminds me of the Akaltik tail with the Roach Domain, which is actually my favorite tail in all of the game. Um, but it does look really good with the other manes too, like that black one with the long mane is literally stunning. My dream with Star Sable would, like, one of them, because I have many dreams with Star Sable, <laughs> like future update wise, but I really wish you could purchase the mane and the tail separately because I think it would really help with the customization of your horse to make it look unique. But yes, I am so excited for these. I wonder what three are going to be first, or four actually. I, I don't know. I'm curious to know how they're going to space these out. That's the big thing, is because there's, there's an even number of them, and we don't normally get even numbers. So we're either going to get four and four, as I said earlier, or I'm not sure how that's going to work. Horror. But yeah, they're gorgeous. I love them and I cannot wait to see your guys' reactions. I know a lot of people are torn about getting so many horses released so often, but um, this breed has been heavily requested for a very long time. So hopefully those that have been wanting a new breed will be excited about this. Of course, they're going to be in the game forever, so you don't have to buy them right away if you are saving up your star coins, which is perfectly fine. Um, we don't know what the cost is going to be yet or anything like that. And if I do f get that information or see it on social media somewhere, I will post it in the video description. But for now... Here is the Mirari. We have seen what it looks like, full body, all the coat colors, and I want to know which one is your favorite. So leave a comment down below, like this video if you like these uh, new spoiler updates, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!